Hello, I'm Brian Whipker, Extension Floriculturalist here at NC State University. In this Plant Growth Regulator Tips podcast, we're going to focus on sprenches. So let's get started. First of all, I'd like to thank Vine Americas for supporting the production of this podcast. So what is a sprench? A sprench is basically a spray application with more volume of solution. And that extra volume gives you more control of plant growth because you have increased contact then with the stem and also the substrate. So the amount of water that you apply with a drench is greater than a sprench, but a sprench is bigger than a spray. And so I'll explain that in a few minutes. So when you look at the movement of plant material or PGRs on plant material, when we apply it. There's the green arrows and that represents xylem movement and red arrows which is the lack of movement and that's because some of these products are not moved in the phloem. And we can see that better here with the application that when we're looking at a foliar spray we don't have that movement out of the leaf and so therefore we're trying to get some contact with that stem or the soil to get increased activity and so we want to have some uh, xylem movement. And that's the idea where we come up with the spray volume of water to use. And that's two quarts per hundred square foot of, of area. And that's because you have enough liquid that's extra that will go on the stem and then down in the soil, and then it's taken up by the plant and the xylem. So you have some duality of both uh, within the leaf uh, where you have the phloem movement and the xylem movement and then xylem movement happening in the stems and up from the root system. Now let's look at a sprench. So what's the difference? The difference is more water. We're increasing it by 50%, now three quarts per hundred square feet. So what's that give you? What that gives you is more solution that goes on the stem and also in the soil and gives you more growth control then because it's transplant ported back up throughout the plant. And that's the idea of a sprint. So if you have a plant that needs more control, you can give it more solution in this fashion and give the plant more uh, height reduction or, or growth reduction along the way. So then the only difference with the drench is we're adding a drench directly to the soil. It's usually a higher volume of solution. And then that's taken up and then uh, by the xylem and transported throughout the plant. So sprinches, if you increase the volume, you're going to provide more growth control. So you can vary the amount of water that you're then applying to help customize your PGR applications. So think about it, that if you have a more vigorous cultivar, if you add a little more solution, more of a sprench effect, you can get that growth control. And then if you have another set of plants that are more sensitive, you can go over it quicker and have less volume being applied. And so you can use one concentration of the PGR and vary it by water volume to get the effects you might want within your greenhouse and it customize it to the response of those plants. So in summary, again, I would like to thank Vine Americas for supporting this podcast. And so when you're looking at sprenches, they involve increasing the, the amount of water that's supplied by 50% as compared to a foliar spray. It really is a heavier foliar application. And that volume can be varied to help customize the dose that you're then giving plants with more solution to more vigorous plants, and you can use less solution to less vigorous plants and kind of even out that growth needs that you have in your greenhouse. So again, thank you for watching this video and hope you enjoyed it.